sends one in. Now Weatherington deflected into the net. Three nothing Portland. Weatherington shot. Goal Portland. What a finish there by Weatherington to give the Pilots the one nil lead. Very grateful for this opportunity and very excited to go play for Houston. I'm excited to be playing with some of the best players in the world in Houston and I can't wait to get there and start training. One of the coolest parts is that Jane Campbell is my best friend and we've been best friends since we were little and we get to play together again. Shot weather to go Portland! Well originally UP was super far away from Georgia and I didn't want to come out here because of that but I decided to give it a visit and I watched the team play the first day I was here in a scrimmage and I just loved the style that they had. So I went into G's office and decided that this was the place for me. That was a beautiful ball from Allison Weatherington, curling ball, far post, plenty of runners for the pilots. When I first arrived to UP, I was still in with the U20 national team. Um, my goal has always been to go pro, so that's what I was focusing on most. I just got to learn from the players around me, especially with people like Amanda Frisbee, Michelle Cruz. Those players really helped me grow with the game. I had her with my first cycle with the under-20 national team. She spent a lot of time in our camps, uh, so I really got to know her during that time. Extremely technical, really good spatial awareness, um, player that's always checking her shoulder, opening her body up the right way to receive a pass, really good at combination play, likes to bust out some tricky moves every once in a while, and she also has a really good free kick, so a lot of good things that she can bring to the table. I think my best on-field attribute would be my technical ability and just being able to distribute the ball well and to find the final pass and just the vision that I have. All growing up, I just worked on free kicks and just told myself like this was going to be the one thing that I was going to be really good at and just tried to master them after every training. And Weatherington goes low, snakes it in, goal Portland. Weatherington set in that low bouncing ball and snuck it just inside that left post. When I first met Frenchie, it was when I was in high school with the U18s. She had a lot of energy every time we stepped on the field. We knew she expected 110% from us, and she's probably one of the best coaches I've ever played for. She just pushed me to be my best every day. Someone like Allison, who's probably more of a technical finesse player, who reminds me honestly a lot of my sister. Um, for Megan, the most important aspect of her training is maintaining strength. And so I kind of use that going into writing Allison's program. This is the strongest she's ever been, so it's exciting to see what that's going to look like on the field in her first season. Having Rachel Rapino train me for the pros has been an awesome experience. She definitely knows her stuff, and I couldn't be more ready for it. On the field, we had some pretty great moments here throughout my career. The Santa Clara game set us up for the WCC title against San Francisco. We played San Francisco and beat them 1-0 and I remember Ellen Parker scoring and we became the WCC co-champs. Parker into the top of the net. Look at that. Pilots take the 1-0 lead. She has the mentality to continue to get better. When you step into a professional environment it can be a little bit intimidating but um, I know that she has the mentality to, to go in there and put her stamp on, on the game and hopefully make Houston even a better team. That is in Portland takes a 2-1 lead on the corner from Allison Weatherington. I definitely feel like I grew as a person and not just an athlete. I made some lifelong friends here as well. That really helped me grow. I had some great teammates and some great coaches and I'll never forget my time here. Playing pro has definitely been one of my dreams all throughout my life and I'm excited for this next chapter.